Roger, congratulations is in order to you as you've now joined Addy Woodman's first team coaching staff. How do you feel? Yeah, really good. Really good. Uh, so it's a nice honour to be asked uh, to step up in, in, and join the first team. Um, <clears throat> clearly, I came in as 23's manager. Um, tiny bit short-lived. I really enjoyed my, my time um, with, with the young lads. Um, but if an opportunity comes up to join, to join senior football, then that, 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 that was always in, in the back of my mind, maybe not as early. But when these opportunities come up, I, f I feel you have to take them. But I, I have to thank uh, Mark Hammond and, and Neil Smith for, for firstly bringing me in the door. <coughs> um, and obviously when the 23s shut down, um, Smudge and, and, and Ammo got, got me in with the first team. Um, so I'll, I'll always be grateful for that. <coughs> um, and, and what's hap happening now is, 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 is great for me. So I guess it's probably not too much different to what you've been doing, obviously, with COVID. You have been working with the first team already, so I guess it's just that continuity now, isn't it? Yeah, it's, it is that. Um, obviously, when, when, when Smudge was here and, and, and Ammo and Dunning and myself, it was, it, we were all, 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 all involved in it. Um, what's happened at the club has it's clearly changed. Um, the gaffer's come in and he's come in and, 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 and liked how it's worked with, with me and Dunny um, and, and him. So yeah, like, like I said earlier, it's a the end game for me is is, is senior football. Um, as, as much as I loved it with the twenty threes um, and, and enjoyed the time with with, with first rolling football um, and, and doing everything with that um, and and doing well in the in the league. Obviously, we finished at the, at the top of it before it broke down um, due to COVID. But yeah, it, look, it, it was the end game for me. So. I'm enjoying it, really enjoying it. And about your time with the under-23s, it was short, but it was also very successful, wasn't it? How would you summarise it? Yeah, look, it was, it was a tough one, because obviously I've come in and, and, and knew, obviously, obviously not a lot of new lads, it was the first year of the 23s actually being um, out in a league <clears throat> and full-time, so that side of it, it was all, it was all really new, and, I, and I, I did love every minute of it. There was a lot of planning. Uh, Mark Hammond helped me so much in, in, in how to... Um, how to work that uh, and, and the games that we played we, we, we did really well in and we like you said we finished at the top of the league but Covid shut it down and um, always bought into how, how I wanted to, them to play and, and to, to uh, be in and around the place and how, how, to, how to train and it wasn't just football I was teaching them it was respect for, 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 for people within the game and, and and just work as hard as you can and, and, and the results will come. And it was just a shame that it did get cut short because they, they were really buying into it and we were on a hell of a run. And presumably you'll be looking at some of the talent in the under-23s to hopefully follow in Jude Arthur's footsteps. Of course, footsteps. and that, that's, another, that's another great thing. Obviously, with the, being with the first team now, I'll always keep an eye out and I'll, I'll go down and I'll still not be involved, but I'll, I'll keep a very, very close eye. I know the lads really well. Um, and look, there's chances at this football club, Liam Vincent, Jude Arthurs, and uh, we've brought young lads in now that, that take Campbell and, and, and Alex Mitchell from Millwall. They're, 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 they're all young lads and they will get chances. So um, they, they know that what it is they need to, what's expected of them through, through the, the time I had with them. Um, but yeah, I'll be keep, keeping a very close eye on, on, on a couple of them and, and bringing them up to this group for training and, and and then it's down to them to, to impress them to, to be involved in, in the first team squad. Roger, thanks for joining us and best of luck. Thank you very much.